Watch this! Um... Probably don't want this with a deck that runs so many 4-mana 7-7s. Seven I want some uh, Brawls and, uh... And uh, Reckless Furries. But thank you for those bits. Appreciate that support. Let's see how many times we can get the Iron Juggernaut going. Maybe I'll even switch to, like, an, uh, like a Dead Man's Iron Juggernaut deck where I can get infinite Iron Juggernauts. Iron Juggernaut won you that game. It clearly means you should put it in your deck. Yeah, I, I feel like Iron Juggernaut is an underrated card for Odd Warrior. And should probably just be an auto-include, right? So we can do Dead Man's with Iron Juggernaut and Dr. Boom, so we can just get as many Iron Jugs as possible. Wait, our opponent didn't upgrade his hero power. Okay. So it could be aggro. I want that uh, Death Lord back, though. Maybe the Fierce Monkey, I guess. Jade or Super Burn Shaman? I'm leaning towards uh, Burn Shaman with a really terrible start, but I don't know. Uh, like, it, it, we're pretty far in the dumpster. It could be just about anything. I unironically un un think it makes more sense to put Iron Juggernaut in Odd Warrior than uh, put Geist in Evil Shaman. <laughs> you and me both. As the win rate with this deck today, I am 2-0 with this particular deck. Okay, so he is aggro. And I do kill that. And he's probably never going to kill us because we just generate infinite amounts of armor. We've got Azelina to snag his hand and burn him down. That'll be fun. Small bit of guild, he has a doggo. Yeah, but, I mean, Teddy's well taken care of. He... He's also just happy that you're here. <laughs> Alright, we've got a pretty good board against what I'm assuming is an aggressive deck. I haven't seen it do anything aggressive yet, but uh, we're making that assumption. Crusher Shaman? Oh, yeah, yeah, he's overloaded. Okay. Good read, Gaga. In which case, uh, the Shield Slam and Super Collider is going to be pretty good. Whereas the uh, the Dynomatic might not be. We just need to be... A the Brawl is also good. We just need to be able to exhaust him of resources here. Goes well with Shambler. Interesting. Interesting. Okay. You definitely got a better read on this deck than I did. I mean, I could just... Uh, no, because I want the Brawls and Shield Slam, so... I'm not going to Azelina yet. But eventually I probably do want to um, Azelina his hand. Alright, show me Baku. <laughs> uh, he wins with the Barnes. Alright. Generate some value. Gets me armor. Gets me more value. I love the, uh, the voice lines of those guys. They're very excited. Uh, do I like the Kingsbane aggro of Kohai? Yes, uh, I love that deck. I've been playing a lot off stream. I played it on stream uh, last, uh, last stream as well. I think it's a really fun deck. I think it's a really strong deck too in the um, in the right meta. That's going to help deal with a very large board. Let's see what we get here first. Cornered Sentry? Probably just okay. Good with Ravaging Ghoul. Good with uh, a board advantage. Not like he's resurrecting things, but it does like actively fill his board, so it makes it harder for him to um, to do spellstone things. Reincarnate uh, KT is going to be a pain. 
Uh, not with the uh, not with the reckless fl flurry pickup, right? Because um, because that just like burns through his whole board. So before that, I think it was. I think it's fine now. What? That's already just like in his deck. I can't let him copy that, right? Uh, not with the Ancestral sp uh, Spirit on it. But I'll just hang out, let him uh, develop a little bit more. Maybe see if I can get a Spellstone out of this. No, I, don't, I think Shield Slime is a little bit too aggressive here. I guess it's probably fine now. What is his hand? I was really hoping to bait out more resources from him. That's it's fine. Yikes. Uh, added the uh, sea captain to aggro kingspain. I think that you'd be, be there are better substitutions you can make if you don't have patches. Just because like Captain is really a lot better with the uh, with the patches in your deck, so you're kind of um, you're losing out on some of the benefit of uh, of Captain when you don't have patches. So I would recommend maybe like a Cutthroat or a Sap, whichever one you're not running. Those would be better. Uh, this makes the the trade less good for him because it um, it dies. So. Okay, that's the second ancestral spirit. Uh, I think that the uh, I think that the aggro king's bane can work without patches, just because like you're more concerned about the. Um, the, the giant king's bane that you're building. So I think it's fine without it. It's just, you know, obviously a bit worse. Because Patches is a very good card. Monka's chat. Monka's. I don't think I want to use the, the big game hunter here. I'll just take it slow. I've still got the flurry. He's only dealing 13. I'm at 57. The more resources I can get him to dedicate into a board, the more satisfying it is to remove them. Yeah, this means he has the um, uh, KT, right? Otherwise, I really don't see him taking that trade. Okay. Well, I was wrong. Want delivery drone? He doesn't know how the 6-9 works. Uh, to be fair, 6-9s can be very confusing. Especially when there's such a big size difference. I mean, I just knew I was going to get Blast Shield, right? Easy game. There's the delivery drone. Okay. Now we just need to find Iron Juggernaut, and we're set. Uh, Reckless Flurry is probably unnecessary. Again, he's only got one 6-9 on board. hey -o! Or we could just full clear with this. So this is a lot more fun, chat. 
It uses all of our mana, which I like. Hmm. Hmm. Full clear or fun clear? Sneeds is always the play. Yeah, you're, you guys are right. I don't know what I was thinking. If he devolves this, I'm going to be quite upset with him. Get the whelp. Get out of here. We're not going for rank one. We're going for rank fun. Nice. Look, if we had taken the whelp, we wouldn't have a Nazdormu on the board, and our opponent wouldn't be panicking right now and potentially making, you know, a suboptimal play. Is he even going to develop anything? Oh, okay. Right, we just need to find that Iron Juggernaut now, and then we win the game, right? What is this? Six mana frogs? Eureka. Yikes. Uh, good thing we have this big game hunter. Do I have a Zola? No, I already used the Zola. Bummer. Mm, no, let's not kill that, because I have a kill on it already. Found you off YouTube. Great vids. Thank you. Thank you, Flippy Flappy. Great nickname. I, I really dig it. Uh, th and thank you for the kind words. Tonight, Appreciate that. And magic. Uh, that's a pretty big yikes. Good thing we saved this uh, big game hunter. Could also just uh, blurry this and then gain some of the armor back. Seems more responsible. The problem is that, like, KT is a thing. Could also brawl and hope for, like, not a bad outcome. I think brawl is better here. I don't think any outcome is bad. So I think it's just brawl. Unfortunate, but uh, not the end of the world. I wanted to save the uh, the BGH, so that's why I didn't just, like, I could have uh, BGH'd it. But I wanted to still have that available to me. Car and explore Ungoro. I was thinking about doing, like, a TOG, um, a TOG warrior with an explore Ungoro soon. Remember when BGH was uh, three mana? Yeah, that's that's a huge mistake. Are we just playing some rag roulette here? Until he develops a little bit more, and I just flurry it. Ooh, blast shield is really good. Okay, so he knows we're going to fatigue, but I think we're at a... Ooh, I did not want to draw a card. Okay. <laughs> it's like he heard us. It's perfect. Yep, this is fine. I have not seen a single spellstone yet, so I don't know. Okay, uh, so this is just fine. Yes! Yes, chat! Yes! This is the only thing that matters. I could have done that in a better order to clear that, but I was too excited about the burrowing mine. Got him. I also don't think a totem is ter terribly relevant here. Okay. Maybe he just doesn't have KT. Ysera? 
Okay, so this is where our flurry comes in. Or I could brawl this. I think brawl is fine. There's a lot of garbage on the board. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, we could force him into fatigue with the Jeeves. It's fine. Like, our game plan is fatigue here anyway, so I'm just okay with him uh, picking up a, another big boy. And just uh, shield block uh, flurry. Or just bite and flurry. Alright, no KT. Turns out he does not have the card that we've been playing around all game. Feels good to punish Big Priest with his Gazodium Age. I agree. That's part of the reason I was playing that deck uh, when I was. Yeah, I might do some Reno Mage. Uh, I'm having a lot of fun with this deck right now, but uh, there will probably be a time when I, if not uh, today, eventually. All right, he needs to go for broke on this unstable evolution. I'll just stay there. That's fine. Seven mana, four, four. I will not be <laughs> <laughs> oh, rip. I wasn't done yet. Let me, let me Jeeves you, bro. 